I will show you my gold route now. We are on Iceland. You need to get to Iceland. And how do you want to get gold? Here's three gold nodes on Iceland. You're only gonna... It doesn't really matter what you, what you do. If you only hit the ice and come back later, the ice will have respawned and you can hit the ice again. But there will be twice the amount as gold in gold coming from it. So now it will uh, give me six. See, six pieces of raw gold. And in about five minutes, ice will respawn. Including the gold uh, note, gold crack, gold note, and then you can hit it again, and that way you can farm gold. If you're in a public server, you might want to make sure you grab the gold as soon as you can. At least with this method that I show you. If you stay at this place, you can uh, guard the place. But we are not going to stay at this place. We are going to travel. Because we will also mine the wealthy god. And his name will tell you already. He is wealthy. This man is wealthy over here. He has got a lot of gold in his eyes. Do you... Do you see the gold in his eyes? Do you do you see the gold in his eyes? Come on, rock climber, fly up there. Thank you. There is the gold in his eyes. See, see, see. There is gold in his eyes. Let's mine him. So I can craft a gold pick. And so I can show you one of the ways to get gold. You don't have to mine the wealthy god, you can skip him if you want to. And immediately go to the next gold node location. that gold for me for me give me that gold I like gold get your fat ass off of that gold my bento okay so we got the gold we don't need the essence we have enough essence and we have enough experience points doesn't want to he doesn't want to the cliff is too hard for him to climb it's too hard don't take him through the water because he's slow in the water and he is quite a guy and rock climbing he's quite OP look at that how good of a rock climber my boy is This is the second location to mine gold. You're going to hit this. You're going to hit this. You're going to take the gold. At least when you're in a public server, you are going to take your gold with you. Otherwise, somebody else might come and steal it while you move on to your next crack of gold. And if you do the round, this round I'm showing you right now, without mining the wealthy god, on an on a animal, which makes you faster. I assure you... The gold will have uh, respawned. 
at your first location. See, you're gonna take this note as well. And now you're going to head back to Ricky the Bento. And you're gonna aim to right over there. Because that was where we started farming gold. See? Location 2 is over there. Location 3 is over there. You might want to build some ducks to get onto location 3. Or put a raft down. If you don't have water walker, like I do. Just to make it efficient and be quick, because you're traveling around and you want to be as, as efficient as you can. That's why we are taking mining from three locations and not just only the one. Because it will give us double the amount of gold, because I took three more nodes in that time. And you see it has respawned, but that's because we also mined the wealthy god. But if you don't mind the wealthy god, it will also have a response. See, there they are. And I will show you now as well the glitch on ice. Because with those two nodes, I only hit the ice. But I didn't mine the gold yet. And this node, I mined the gold. So this node should give me six pieces of gold again. Well, these notes now should give me 12 pieces of gold. You see? Let's double the amount. I just like to <coughs> immediately, in my, immediately mine it. Because in a public server, someone else might come to your location and take your gold. Well, what you also could do now is uh, make campfires and also cook your gold, but I advise you to do that at the end of your runnings on your first location, because that's where the most gold spawns, three in one spot, and this is three divided over two locations. You see, now we don't mind the wealth he got. We're heading over to location 2 again. Oh, little Bento has stuck under the ground. You see, he's just stuck in the ground right there, my boy. Now he's stuck in the bush. Oh, there he is. That was cute. Cute little Bento. Bye, boy. You can ride him as well if you like. But as you see, they might get stuck underground. Which makes for a funny view if you're riding with your legs in the ground. So you only see a torso. You only see a torso of yourself. So this six times six, if you do the route once. That means 36 pieces of gold. <clears throat> By traveling across ice. So if your only purpose is at that moment farming gold. This is the method that I suggest you take. Build docks or craft a raft. If you don't have the water rocker. Or even a sailboat to be quicker. If you have the water walker, use it. Don't take the bento because it's so slow in the water. I think the only animal that is quite okay in water is uh, the mammoth. And I believe it's both the big mammoth as the baby mammoth. Big mammoth, baby mammoth, baby mammoth. He gave birth to two babies. We don't need to go that way, actually. 
so yeah let's head over to our first location again and as you can see the gold has already respawned over there you see one two three notes have i been so slow because it might happen that you see him growing right now but i probably was slow or something i'm always so slow i'm so slow so let's end the video right here have a good day you all bye